Atlanta on the campus of Ball State University. Welcome inside Worthen Arena. It's cold and snowy outside, but nice and warm here in Worthen. We've got Mac Men's basketball for you as the Ball State Cardinals take on the Buffalo Bulls. Or he's going to get fouled and go to the free throw line. He does a great job at driving the lane. Barry this time finds an open Posley. He missed that short, but Kamenecki has his fifth rebound already. The bomb! A monster dunk for Chris Bond, and the Cardinals are back up six. We do. He just stood there literally, literally with his hands straight up. And McCray, that's his strength, powered up and in. Now we're working the other way. Fields into the lane to Kamenecki. Mosley left open for three, and he knocks it down. So the first three-pointer for Ball State comes from Marcus Mosley. To the corner to Rayleigh Ross. Out to Regan for three. He knocks it down. Will Regan, one of the top three-point shooters at 51%, and he leads the Cardinals in scoring and rebounding so far on the day. He's well on his way to a double-double. You know, in his last, his first start of the season, you know, tied his career high with 10 rebounds. He's well on his way tonight. There's Will Regan again. He knocks down a three, and we are tied here at Worthen Arena for the first time. And you can guarantee those nine fouls. That's going to come into play with about, you know, three or four minutes into this ballgame. It's going to be huge. And just as impressive, the Cardinals have been able to keep Buffalo away from the foul line. But that's Tony Watson, and he gets all three of those. Xavier Ford with it up top. They continue to these quick, high-velocity passes around the perimeter trying to catch someone off guard. We talked to assistant coach Mitch Gilfill, and he said this is one of the most dangerous offenses we've seen, and you see it right there as Will Regan knocks down the three, and Buffalo goes back up one. Eighth with 12 points on the day. He's second to Majuk on the team, who has 13. There's Scaife open for three, and he got it! And the Cardinals have taken the lead back. A quick 5-0 run. Back to their money man, McCray, who makes Kamenicki miss again and slams it. 22 for Javon McCray. Shot clock down to five. Watson on the screen. They're in trouble. They'll go back to Regan. A long three. And it goes! Unbelievable. Regan gets the biggest shooter's roll of the day here at Worthen Arena. And the last thing the Cardinals could have taken there was a three-pointer. Let's look at this one again. I mean, how far does this ball bounce up? It goes above, above the, shot the shot clock. You never see that. You see it touch the shot clock maybe, but you don't. You do not see it jump bounce so high off the back rim. They've got to hurry. Well, work to bear. They don't have time for this. Skate will try a three and hit it. So it's a one-point game. And in the mind of Jawan Scaife, almost a sarcastic look of where was that? And they're not going to get it. So 66 to 63 is the final. Buffalo holds on to beat Ball State here inside Worthen Arena. The Bulls move to two and three in Mid American Conference play. Ball State will fall to one and four and seven and ten on the season.